Hey everybody, today's video we're going to be showing you how we built our lovely schoolie couch here. We built this back in March of this year, 2019. Today we're building a couch in the schoolie. Um, pretty simple, we got all of our stuff from Lowe's. Uh, you can get it from any hardware store though. I'm definitely going to need some of these, some impact drivers. Our issue is we're building it over the real well. It's kind of the biggest hurdle. theme I've heard the last couple days. Measure twice, four or five times. Cut one. Yeah. You got a box. So what we did was had all the uh, pieces of wood pre-cut at Lowe's for us. It was a th three quarter inch birch I believe. They cut all the pieces for us and then the top piece we actually just cut a little in the back room made space where we put a hinge so that it could lift up. This really nice blonde oak. And then uh, we took extra flooring that we had and we covered the wheel well just to make it all look nice. But we can take all of this and fill it with storage, different bins. It can just, it can be whatever. So we're proud of it. So we did it. <laughs> Don't mind my uh, first attempt at <laughs> handles, but uh, you know. We were inspired by the Urban Outfitters day bed cushion and we ordered it and essentially built our couch container and storage box to fit the specs for this couch. So we wanted to keep the design really open and clean and essentially put a cushion over it and then accent it with other cushions. Basically the idea of the couch was we needed to build something that would fit over the wheel well here but also provide storage underneath the couch because we have a shorter bus and storage is essential. So we usually, in order to open the couch, we move everything out of the way to open it up completely. But just to show you, we have these handy little hangers and all under here is storage. So it's essentials that we aren't using all the time in our kitchen. It's cleaning supplies, um, extra, extra toiletries and bath stuff. Um, but usually we'll take all the pillows off and this is what the top of it looks like. As you saw in the video, um, Aaron's lovely uh, handle work, but it works great. And there's actually a little space for the hinges to work properly. So when you lift it up completely, look at all that storage. And we usually, it's a little ghetto, but we usually just take a little piece of wood and voila, there's our under bed, under couch storage. Boom, so there it is. This is our simple little couch that we built for the bus. We love it. Uh, if you guys have any questions at all, if we didn't explain anything, uh, just feel free to leave us a comment below and we'll try to answer those as best we can. We're super thankful for friends that know how to build things and yes. encourage us along the way. Absolutely. And we're excited. Hey, and stay tuned for a full bus tour very soon. So soon. Cheers. Take care. Bye. Um, <laughs> what, you don't want to be in the YouTube vlog? Well, I'm trying to do that, y'all. I don't know what you're talking about. As long as my salad hides my okay. bacon habanero <laughs> pretzels and cheese. That's good. Huh? Om chanty om. <laughs>